you so much for the wonderful positive energy vibration let's see this is the second week of october and in this week is week number 41 in this week let's see what's coming up for you aries okay so um thank you please like share these videos share 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 to see what is coming up for you aries and let's take a look to see um what's coming up please like share these videos and uh, um don't forget some news is coming in for you aries whatever is transpiring some news are here some news are coming in for you aries okay so um the week begins from the 7th until the 13th okay so there is a situation that you're not seeing clearly whatever that is there's a situation that you're not seeing clearly okay some of you are going back to the drawing decks to think and to see what you can change which is very good definitely some news are coming in whatever the news is um it's going to be helping you to move forward and to understand what's happening the hardship is uh, coming to an end um so whatever the de this deceptiveness that was going on the truth uh, is going to is has come out and some of you are not understanding what has just taken place okay so um that can happen to people sometimes the eight of swords is definitely here and uh, there's definitely um, not seen clearly and you guys are trying to find out uh, a situation with a conflicts. Okay, so the conflicts, the conflicts is definitely over because the conflicts is in your foundation and it's definitely over. But um, the four of pentacles is in the reverse. Okay, so there you are going back to the drawing board so as we look at this issue and this situation there is something that you're definitely not seeing clearly okay so you need to um go back and kind of figure out what exactly took place and what is transpiring some of you are thinking planning and thinking some of you it's not really regret it's just planning and thinking thinking about your financial um stability and the conflicts that was there okay here you can see that happening news are coming in that is going to help you financially um whatever has transpired in the past i'm seeing you trying to shed light on the future to see what direction where are you going to be going and this is going to be good so um for the angels and guides uh, we're calling up on the angels and guides to show us what extra is going on but whatever is that the news is coming um to you about some money and the conflicts is over so um let's see what you're not seeing clearly some of you want to, a new start but you're still looking back at the past so it's as if something has transpired in your life and you definitely want to move forward but instead of moving forward you're looking back at the past okay and it has to do with work so some of you could have been released from your work and you're still you know having this so it says why um why has this happened so what they're saying now it is time for you to move forward whatever is happening whatever is transpiring they're saying now it's time for you to move forward okay whatever has happened in the past and leave it in the past don't look back just move forward and try to build a new foundation it has to do with work for some of you some of you realize that um work is um wherever you were working or whatever was going on at your work you weren't seeing it clearly and now um you're out of it and you're trying to move forward now we have the energy that you're standing your ground protecting yourself standing your ground standing against a situation and there's going to be some judgment call so there could be some judgment call um, about um, information that you will receive from your work so that could be coming up in this week 
whatever the judgment call is it has to do with work for some of you it have to do with a, a home but it has something to do with financial so maybe you were trying to find a new apartment but whatever it is is as if uh, you know you're receiving new um, places but it's too expensive and you're trying to protect yourself some of you are dealing with an older man this is a taurus virgo or capricorn and you're going to be receiving a message from this person this is a taurus virgo or capricorn this could be your father this could be a partner this could be um your boss this could be your supervisor i'm seeing you receiving some message from this person the message that is coming in um it's about a celebration so some good news is going to be coming in for you um, this could be your husband and some good news is going to be coming in for you and it has to do with something to do with your stability and balance it could be with financial stability love is here um, I'm seeing um, some of you who have kids I'm seeing love from your kids is going to be coming up so if there were some issues um, I'm seeing your kid there is going to be good news that is coming in so if you have a child um, um, I'm seeing that um, whatever hardship the child was in it is now over whatever hardship the child was in it's over I'm seeing you really really ha happy because um, you have gotten a child out of a serious serious problem that was happening okay whatever that you need to do in this week it is a yes if you have a question it is a yes um whatever you have to do in this week now there's some worries because some information came out and you're worried about this situation whatever it is you're very worried about the situation you're worried about some information that came out now it could be that you're receiving some a worrisome message from your child whatever it is this is going to be coming to an end okay whatever worries that you have whatever worries that has transpired it is going to be coming to an end okay there we go so um the hermit um some information came out whatever this information is that came out it created some worries um some problems in your life but this is going to be ending um very soon the Knight of Cups is here. This is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. Whoever this person is, is coming up as a Scorpion, and it has something to do with a work situation for some of you, and it could have to do with a house situation, okay? There are definitely regrets. Regrets. Um, um, you guys are having regrets. You, you, you can't see a situation um, about a... Um, Pisces cancer or a scorpion whoever this person is is a scorpion so some of you are having issue with this person this person could be a partner this person is definitely either on the work floor or at home because here I'm seeing you having and receiving you're going to be receiving some message from this person and the message is not going to be a, a happy one because I'm seeing some regrets um you did not see this coming in from this person okay the um eight of cups is when you are now out of the dream phase some of you are dealing with a scorpion some of you are dealing with a um uh um some of you are dealing with a scorpion this is the energy of a scorpion coming up then we have uh, the energy of uh, the Pisces okay then we have the energy of the Pisces and whatever the conflicts is that you were having or whatever communication it is that you were having with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius this is going to be over because here it is whatever this the situation whoever this person is and however they plays in your life I'm seeing a transition coming in because I'm seeing that the truth is going to be coming out about something and the truth has come out about something and what is transpiring here is that the emotional situation that you had with this person is as if 
some of you this person um, should have paid you some money this person did not come through with the money and you are leaving this behind and you're deciding I'm leaving this conflicts behind with this person and I'm moving forward because this doesn't serve me anymore and this is really good because you're understanding whatever this person has done is something that was injustice now I'm seeing transition coming in for this person I'm seeing you having a lot of regrets a, a lot of you are having a lot of regrets whoever this person is whether it's your partner your husband um, uh, um, uh, ex boss or whatever there is really some deceptive uh, situation that has transpired because it's as if this person and hold you hold some illusion around you or by you and now you're seeing through that issue and that illusion definitely a lot of you are dealing with scorpions in this week between the ages of 18 and 45 they could be kids at home they could be your partners but uh, you're definitely going to be receiving some message from this person and you're going to be seeing the truth because whatever this is you're going to be having some regrets now um, here love is coming up especially with the kids for the people who were worried about their kids there's no need to worry because a situation is going to be balanced out there's transition that is coming your worries is going to be over whatever it is move forward okay try and move forward you're still going backwards and you need to move forward you need to let go of this work this issue this house this apartment whatever it is just move forward now the king of pentacles is going to be bringing in some good news for you whoever this person is this person is coming up as your partner and this person it could be over kids or some issue that there was with kids but definitely some real positive news is going to be coming out so it's not a bad week it's just that you are trying to figure out things that you weren't aware of teacher comes up for you so whatever is happening teacher this is a situation that you guys are having with an organization and whatever this organization or whatever as uh, transpires some of you are dealing with picking up the pieces where there is some situation that has transpired and there's going to be a judgment call that is coming up to you so you got to be aware and you got to be um, aware of whatever is going on because some judgment call so it's about you learning something or some of you teaching others something in this week so I want to say thank you for being here namaste until next time